In the year 1899, a young man was born. His name was Adam Rayner. And Adam Rayner has a very distinct historical award. He's the only person to have experienced both of these things in his lifetime. You see, Adam Rayner, until the age of 18 years old, grows to four feet tall, maybe a hair over four feet tall. That classifies him in what's called dwarfism. He was very short, very thin, and very weak. But soon, by his 21st birthday, things started to change. And from the time he's 21 until the time he's 31, Adam grows to be seven foot two. He passes away at a height of seven foot eight inches tall, classified at the end of his life with gigantism. To have dwarfism and gigantism in someone's life is not a very common thing, but it happened to him. My friends, this is not just a random historical fact. Oftentimes a person finds an area in which they struggle and feel in a moment of inspiration that they need to do things differently. They got to shake it up. They got to take another path. And we try to change and change in a beautiful way. But one thing you need to understand is that Adam Rayner dies at the age of 51. Because when a person grows so much, so fast, the body can't handle it. The heart, the liver, the kidneys struggle to be able to deal with growth that is happening so quickly. The body can't sustain that level of growth. Many times a person is faced with a nisayon such as Shmirate and Aim, and suddenly they find, they feel, they see a Vayimayan video and they decide that things are going to be different. And oftentimes if things don't change 100% in one second, we're not happy with ourselves. But that's not how healthy or sustained growth works. If a person was falling 10 times a year and they break it down to five times, that's amazing. If they were falling 10 times a day and they break it down to five times a day, that's amazing. True growth happens in normal, in measured steps. And I want to tell you a secret. HaKadosh Baruch Hu doesn't want growth that's impossible to sustain either. So take one step at a time and you'll find a level of growth that you can sustain over your entire lifetime.